we address the tornado stuff? We can. It happened. <laughs> it happened. <laughs> it did. <laughs> we didn't see it. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. Hi, Hi Reaverland. Reaverland. How you doing? Hey, that was good. I'm John. <laughs> I'm Dave, uh, CFO here, Brother Dave, not a priest. Mm -hmm. uh, and I'm John. I am, I'm in charge of casting and I do tours here, which I'm doing a tour right after this. Oh. So, yeah. That will be fun. Yeah, if you're ever in town, just email us. They're free. And it's tours at... Uh, ReaperMini.com. Tours at ReaperMini.com. He does an excellent tour. Thanks for the sub. Thanks for the sub, Mini Wizard. Yeah. Neurocrog, uh, Snowstiff. Hey, guys, hey. how's it going? Yeah, how's it, how's it going today, guys? I'm so... Uh, a lot of people are... Hey, there's Forever right. Night, yeah. A lot of people are say, spelling my name right. That's awesome. <laughs> I got to talk with Forever Night this Saturday. Mm -hmm. Came by the shop. Yeah, the paint club, which yeah. happens here at the factory. Uh, every Saturday from 12 to 4. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Archbishop uh. Dave. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you missed the tornadoes last night. Yes. Yes, yes Justin? We did have some uh, tornadoes here last, uh, last night. Yeah. Down in Dallas area. Mainly it was Dallas and east of Dallas. Yeah, by Love we, Field. Yeah, Airport. we just got some. In our area, we just got a little bit of hail. hail. How about you? Yeah, a little bit of hail in my area, too. Yeah. Yeah. And so, what's, what's today, Dave? Oh, today Monday is blues. Monday blues. Let's chase away the blues. And how are we chasing away the blues, Dave? Uh, well, every time <laughs> someone gifts a sub in our chat or on our show, we match it. Yeah. And as Perfect. a bonus, it comes out of Justin's pay. Yeah. <laughs> That's definitely a bonus. So make it hurt. Yeah. So we're matching all gifted subs today. So if you gift subs, we're uh, Reaper Miniatures as a channel, we will be gifting subs to match everyone. To and so, speaking of, speaking of that, it's going to lead right into the giveaway. Oh, um, there's so, nuts and stitches, yeah. So, people that are in chat, you've probably seen people typing in hashtag paints with an S. Paints. Um, hey, Vanquisher, thanks for there the gift. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, and Bjorn Tork, thank you. Thanks, Bjorn. Um, if you look at the bottom here, we were giving, a, at 1,700 backers, we will be giving away uh, top 100 Bones models and top 50 DHL metal models. Mm -hmm. uh, so, we'll be doing that giveaway at 1,700. But currently, we got to 1,300 subs last week, and that was our goal. And we, we are giving away one of each paint that we have in production. So the way that you enter that is if you do hashtag paints and chat. If you've already done it, you'll, you only need to do it once. And it's going to be lasting a week. There you so go. Yeah. This, this Thursday, during Reaper Live, mm -hmm. uh, we will be drawing the name. Thanks, Buglips. Right. Thank you, Buglips. Uh, we will be drawing the name for who wins that paint. Paint. Mm -hmm. And we are um, working with uh, Kit, our webmaster, and Ron to get the handle, the Twitch handle, mm -hmm. of the person up on the website so you don't even have to come back and watch the show again, but I think it would be great if you did. But <laughs> uh, you can just go right to the website to find out if you won the paints. Yeah. It will also, oh. no. also be on YouTube, I have my button. Yeah, the YouTube. It will? Yeah, yeah. okay. So you'll put the winner's name in the title? Correct. It'll be, <laughs> well, that or it'll also be in the description. It'll be everywhere. So it'll be hard for the person who wins to actually miss. Yeah. Good chance they'll actually probably be in chat, though. Wow, I've seen a lot of there. hashtag paints. Yeah. I wonder if all these people are entering for the first time. I don't uh, know. Thanks, Jaden you only can do it, you, you can do it all you want, but it's only going to count once. Once. So all you got to do is just do it once, and you'll get a, you'll get a message from Moobot. Is that correct? Saying that you've entered? Uh, yes, it yes. will, and it'll it'll keep sending you them as you type in paints, but you're only getting one. Yeah, you're only, only getting, getting one, one entry. Correct. So. Only one entry. It's not like where you put in a hundred raffles, yes. and then you have a more greater chance. No, it's just one one entry. That's no, Minath, uh, it's actually all of those minis are going to one person. Yes. Ah. The top uh, one hundred uh, bones and the top fifty DHL. Uh, DHL. Mm -hmm. That will be the giveaway at 1,700 subs here on the bottom of your screen here. Which we are at 1,302. Mm -hmm. Yes. I see Diggy. Diggy's first time on Twitch. Welcome. We're glad to have you. Oh, hi, Diggy. <laughs> yeah, I like to see new, uh, new people. Yeah. So just remember, you only need to enter it once. Once. Don't just spam paints all, all episode. All you got to do is enter it once. And the chat will be open, so even if Reaper is not live. Broadcasting. You can just come into chat and do hashtag paints and it'll still enter you. Which I checked last night and I think there were 72 people that had done that yeah. so far. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Morning. Morning, hey, Nathan Works. How's the land down under down there? Uh, so, Nathan Bia, we were at 1300 before. Why did it go down? Uh, so, a lot of the times your Twitch Prime subscriptions, uh, they like roll over or they fall off. Or they fall off, yeah. yeah. Uh, I was gifted a sub for uh, Mocha mini Minis. Mm -hmm. And uh, when I was going on to renew my subs, I found out that there was like four days left. Mm -hmm. So, I went ahead and upped for uh, Mocha Minis. Uh, but yeah, it will fall off at any given time. It's only good for uh, one, month. Third, one month. Yeah, 30 days. Yeah. 
31 days. Thanks for every night for the Twitch Prime. Oh, thank you. Uh, for anybody that's new, if you don't know what Twitch Prime is, it's if you have an Amazon Prime account, you can link it to your Twitch account. Uh, and when you do that, you get one free sub a month. So, yeah, you see all these people subscribing with Twitch Primes. That's yes. what that means. And for the mm -hmm. Thanks, not, Wendy. not so technically advanced like me on <laughs> Twitch, I found out this weekend that using your iPhone, you cannot sub. You actually have to go to the Twitch website mm. to renew your subs and whatnot. Uh, awesome. So. Uh, uh, no, we do not, Taz Lanch. Uh, I'm sure I could get a count from Justin, uh, exactly how many people have entered. Oh. I can give you the exact number. Ah, and we can get that. Justin is on the spot. Yeah. Do you have anything to say to us, uh, sir? Your venerable Ron Hawkins? Mr. President? We are up to 602 entries. 602. Oh, okay. oh. oh. Yeah, oh. go ahead and put that on the table if you want. Very nice. Oh, okay. No. Oh, we're teasing oh, that from behind Oh, he's teasing. The... Hey, guys. Oh. We have uh, so. uh, 1845 dollars to go before we tease you. Oh. oh. And the next unlock? Right, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So Ron's showing us, a, for those of you who can't see, which you can't. Yes, uh, Sigwolf. That's what I ended up having to do is go to my mobile browser and open up Twitch there. That's how I kind of figured it out. Ron oh. is showing us a print that is uh, coming up and it is really cool. Yeah. Right. Really and cool. And it looks... Maybe we'll show it off. Yeah, it's a couple so, inches. Can, can we give the name of it? Three, to, oh, to let their imagination three, three run inches, wild? Yeah. So, so we, we already previewed this on Reaper Live, but a lot, of, a lot of people on Twitch have not seen it yet. Yeah. Oh, look at that. So if you guys want to dig back on old Reaper Live episodes, <laughs> you will have seen it. Quick, flip the camera around. <laughs> hey, Nikki Coles, welcome. Um, so... Let's just talk about what happened over the weekend. Uh, the Elemental Scions got unlocked. Yeah. Um, so we're, we are on Monday. So Elemental Scions got unlocked. I see a lot of people asking about the Air Scion. Um, it is, we, we have some concept art for it, and it is being worked on. Uh, and it will be added maybe into some kind of future thing. It, we don't know where exactly it's going to fit yet, but we do have it. I see a lot of people asking, where's the Air Scion? If you want so. a female Air Scion, get the Genie from the... Bones 3? I hope Bones 4. I forgot. Whoa, we're on Burns 5 already. Yeah. I know. I know <laughs> um, so anybody that's new, thanks, Vanquisher. Thanks. <laughs> for the Tier 3. That's a Tier 3, yeah. And, oh, and Flimdizzle, 555. Oh. Thanks for the Twitch Prime. Yeah. Um, so yeah, the Elemental Scions got unlocked this weekend, so the, those are a $12 option. You can add them to your core set. I add, add them as an option, not to your corset, to your box. And also note at the bottom there, back to the uh, subs where you're giving away the top 50 and the top 100. Note that there's still 70 days to go. Mm -hmm. Justin has opened it up till December 31st. Yeah, so not the just for the, uh, the Kickstarter campaign, but to December 31st to try and get that many subs. Yep. Um, and then currently we are working towards the Brindwind expansion. Uh, so or brandy wine, if you brandy wine, <laughs> the brine wind expansion. Uh, take away that graphic so we can see the full top of this bad boy. Oh, he's busy. Justin's busy. <laughs> I, I mean, Vanquish had a tier three. I'd add him oh. to the list. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do we do we have a name for um, the pumpkin model that is being yeah, sculpted? Yeah, Mike the, Disney's uh, pumpkin the pole. Model? When does that pole close, Justin? For Mike Disney, uh, I don't know. It's his. It's his poll. It's, it's oh, poll. is it? Okay. It is, oh, it okay. Is. All right. Well, we'll we'll find out soon, and hey, then we'll come back. Can you put the link up on on chat for us, Justin? There you go. There, there you go. go. For anybody right that's, on it. For anybody that's in chat, you can look at the straw poll. Uh, you click on that, and it'll take you to a, a poll, and you does get it the show a picture as well. Uh, I think so. no, 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 it does not. Okay. We we show the picture if we have it. Um, I'm sure Justin does. We're trying to oh, put oh, him on the spot. Oh, I do. He has. Oh, he does. There it is. There it is. So this was concept art done by, or it was just, it wasn't concept art, it was just a drawing that he did yes. uh, for Inktober, if you know what Inktober is. Uh, Inktober is a lot of people who draw, mm -hmm. they try to draw a, do, a new picture each day. Yeah. And it's like a challenge oh. kind of a thing. And this was one of the things that he did for Inktober. Uh, and right now we are currently naming it. Um, and we reached out through to him. Through the straw and, poll. Yeah. yeah, through the straw poll and chat. Uh, and we're currently naming it. Uh, he actually drew this and it was painted and all this other stuff and then now we're sculpting it and turning it into a model. I think the when I took the poll I think Lord of the Gourds. Gord Lord or Gord Lord, Lord was, was Lord Lord winning Lord. the poll. Yeah. Overgord is, Over is leading by There you go. Thank you. Pans, uh, the Overgord. Overgord is the best. So a lot of people in chat seem to be like an all hell the Overgord. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so that that's a cool story from someone in our community on Twitch that we reached out to and we like the art that he did. Mm -hmm. Thanks oh, Apes, Apes Among Us. Among Us. Thank you. Um, so yeah, we're working towards the Brian Wynn expansion right now. Yeah. 
which is really cool. And it just so happens if, if just see, we're just going to work Justin to death. <laughs> He's going to ask for a raise. Can yeah. we get the QVC? <laughs> oh, QVC, <laughs> yes. Uh, can do that. So. There you go. You take the Toki Pokemans away. Thanks. There you go. There we go. Awesome. But these are some of the, if, if anybody watched the, the Bob, Bob Rodolfi video interview. that's up on YouTube. Mm -hmm. He showed these off in his interview that we have on YouTube. Uh, these are all the different types of pirates. He said that he sculpted them in groups. Mm -hmm. uh, I watched the interview. He said he has like some drunken pirates. He has some pirates that are looting, like carrying the treasure. And here's but, your, your drunken <laughs> pirates right here. Yeah, the one next to it too on the barrel. Yeah, the uh, one digging. The one with the shovel, the one with the pick, and the one carrying the uh, treasure chest are the ones that are searching. Treasure crew. The treasure, treasure crew. crew. And yeah. then we have the boarding party. Which are the people who are with the boarding. axe and the sword and the double knife, short, yeah, the cleaver, or short sword, yeah, the cleaver. Yeah, so there's your, awesome. there is your, uh, there's your treasure chest pirate. Yeah, so these, these are just some of the models that are in the Brian expansion, and some of you guys noticed from the Reaper Live episode that we did, the Sons of Bardi, there on the bottom left, uh, the guys that have been eaten by the hagfish. Um, I know a lot of people were scared of the holes and stuff in the yeah. body, but. <laughs> It only adds to it, um, especially like the, I, I was, John had to tell me that, uh, oh, there, there it you is. go. Yeah. Yeah. There's a close-up of the now, Sons of Bardi. what is, the, again, the story, it, uh, you, you, they got pulled under? Mm -hmm. And then eaten by the hagfish, and that's Captain Bardi on the left, and his private, his first, first mate. First mate. First mate. Yeah. Uh, did he have a name? First mate? Uh, right just the first mate? His, his first just mate. first mate. First mate. Both traitorous pirates. Traitorous pirates. Who betrayed the accords of Brywin mm. and were punished. Yeah, this is Dreadmere's story written by Joseph Wolf. Brian Wynn's story. Brian Wynn's story. story. Oh, by Joseph oh. Wolf. I didn't know oh, that. Oh, the guy who also writes for who our ReaperCon stuff. Oh, um, okay. Yeah, but this is for Brian Wynn. Yeah. Brian Wynn's our pirate setting we used for Oh, Reaper. I didn't know that. Totally different. Totally different yeah, setting. Yeah, yeah. Same, same, uh, same, same writer. I knew there was a cool. something behind the name. Yeah, and so these I are the, know Joseph these are the first it. sons yeah. of Barty. Uh, so I saw a lot of people saying, how can Barty become a part of his own Sons of Barty. Um, but <laughs> well, he's the for, creator of it. From Arkansas. <laughs> yeah. um, there's rumor we may get a, a, another actual Son of Barty. Oh, oh okay. Rather yeah. than Barty and his first mate himself, we're going to get Would that be also in the other unlocks for the Brynwyn expansion? Mm, mm. Maybe. Yeah. So I'm getting tired of holding this, so I'm just going to bring it to you guys. Oh, okay. You guys... Yeah. Uh, yeah just so we're right. currently at 2143. Mm -hmm. Uh, and this unlocks oh, okay. at, oh, it doesn't have the unlock amount. Oh, yeah, it does. 2145. You're actually going to show this? Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Oh, okay. There you go. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Uh -oh, Way bigger. Guys. And this is called? Fathom Tyrant. Fathom Tyrant. So this is called the Fathom Tyrant. Can we get Tyrant in chat, please? Oh, thanks, Arrow Gator. Oh, wow, this guy's way bigger than Big. I Big, yeah. Uh, was crap. this shown off at ReaperCon? No, it's uh, on Reaper Live? I believe, I believe both. Reaper Live. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think it was at ReaperCon. This is part of the next reveal. Next oh. reveal. So we're only uh, $1,500 away or so from revealing the next thing, and this guy's part of that. Oh, okay. So, so we're about $1,500 away. He's about to get his head pinched off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Fathom Tyrant. See, a lot of people are typing Tyrant in chat. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Yeah, so this is a part of the next unlock. Uh, so here in about $1,500. And but so you've got, oh, he's like with a pile of skeletons and skulls mm -hmm. and treasure and, treasure and stuff like that. His little tentacles. Yeah. Well, you just go ahead and put a boat on there. Just, just <laughs> yeah, it's sunk Just in get the that whole sea theme. He's, he's underwater, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Fathom Tyrant. Can the claw hold a mini? That's a good question. Um, so of course, I was about to find out. We can try. I don't know. I think that one you could. Yeah, uh, you could if a little work. Yeah, sure. little work. Maybe a little, uh, what is it, painter's yeah. tack? Yeah, you could put some, yeah, just glue them on there. Glue them in there. Psh. Make them yeah. hold, hold a mast of a pirate, of a ship. Sure, you could be wrecking things. Yeah. Creepy crustacean. I love it. Yeah, <laughs> no, that is cool. I like that. Yeah, give me tyrant. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, here we go. We'll have them, Can't uh, fathom how I'll use it. <laughs> have them sneaking up on uh, Sir Forescale there. I expect pledges <laughs> to, remi to rise... Uh, uh, Ten thousand percent. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't moved since we put them down. Oh. Oh, yeah. they're 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 busy overloading the Kickstarter. I guess so. <laughs> so we're about fifteen hundred away, and this guy, this little preview that you're seeing on screen here, is going to be a part of the next unlock um, that we're going to show as soon as we unlock the Brinewin expansion. So this is the one after Brinewin. Yes. Yeah. Okay. This is a little preview of what's coming. Very nice. I like that. We try to show you guys as many previews as we can. I like the, uh, what is it, the Anchor of Damnation. Yeah. I like on that the bottom one. left. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I think Actually, I like them all. I like skeleton stuff. A really anyway, cool set so, piece. Yeah. And this is only part one of this expansion, so there's still a lot more to oh, come. Oh, cool. Yeah. So Ron hinted at a third <laughs> son of Barty. So, yes. Uh, to go with the other sons of Barty there. Mm -hmm. uh, I like the captain that's on the bottom right there. Uh, I saw the green of that, mm -hmm. the original piece of this. And I believe the he's going to come separate. So mm -hmm. if you wanted to put that guy in a set piece, some kind of diorama yeah. or something like that, it'd be very good. Uh, did we get a... Oh, man, Ron's not here. I was going to ask for the count of the Kickstarter mini, or the um, social media mini, the, in, the engagements. Oh, yeah. Um, so if we zoom out here, we'll talk about... Um, did you want to talk about the Jim Dragon and the Loot Gun? Yes, the okay. social media minis. Okay. Nice segue, Dave. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Playing uh, it that way. So we're going to be talking about the Jim Dragon. So this is our current social media mini along and with... Cue um, the Jim Dragon from yeah. Justin there, please. Greg Elfslayer was our first social media mini. Uh, generally, when we do these Kickstarters, we try to do... Thanks, Beard of Troll, for the Tier 1. Mm -hmm. uh, every time we try to do these Kickstarters, we try to do a social media mini that we add into the corset. Yes. And this time, we're doing multiple. Yes. And so this is our second one. Uh, and this is the Gym Dragon. Um, so if we get to 5,000, this will be unlocked and added to the core set. And, and we don't have a count on that just yet. Correct. Um, Ron just left. I was asking oh, him. But Bamon 2525. Thanks for the Thank you. And he, Bearded Troll. Oh, thanks, oh, Bamon. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I said Bearded Troll. Yeah, tier one. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Um, but these, this Gym Dragon is going to be cast in translucent color. So I think the current plan is he's going to be kind of red or blue or yellow or I'm talking purple. with Ron because there's been a lot of people on Twitch saying just cast just clear. It, just clear. Yeah. So I've been talking with Ron about that. So let me see it in chat if you still want the uh, the clear. Yeah. Clear or colors. Because this is a good feedback for us is yeah. the uh, the comments and this chat here. I see clear. Yeah. Please just colorless. So I've seen one random color. And a bunch wow. of clears. Oh, color. <laughs> it's two colors. Any idea of the size? Oh, uh, so Diggy, he's going to fit on a two-inch base. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm seeing a lot of clear. Yeah. Three colors and a bunch of clears. Um, so, yeah, he's going to come on a two-inch base. Mm. I thought we did. We, I guess we don't. I mm. thought we had one. Clear with a random bottle of paint. That sounds like a good compromise. That's what, that's what yeah. <laughs> <laughs> clear color. Yeah, I see a lot of clears. Um, well, maybe we could put a poll up on the Kickstarter or something. Yeah. That sounds like a good idea. Or on the Facebook. Create a poll. I'll, I'll probably think about doing that. So I'll talk to Ron about that. Thanks, Incubus Games, for the Tier 1. Mm -hmm. Or he gifted Tier 1. Um, so this is the current uh, social media mini. <laughs> uh, and all you got to do is use the hashtag Bones5Core, just like you see on the graphic there. Uh, so if you go to our social medias, uh, there's a banner on the Kickstarter page. There's a bunch of banners at the bottom mm -hmm. that will say all of our social medias. You can click on those banners and it will take you to our, our social medias. Uh, same thing for on the Twitch channel. If you're watching on your desktop, uh, you can just go underneath the video feed and it'll have all the banners there. So you can click on them and go to our social and media. And so we do the Twitter, Twitch, uh, Facebook. Instagram. Instagram. Mm -hmm. And I think Ron created a um, a Pinterest this weekend. Oh, did he? Uh, apparently a lot of people were using Pinterest this weekend to kind of share oh. the Gym okay. Dragon. But uh, keep, an, keep an eye out on that for, for the future. Um, and I kind of posted it on Reddit and stuff, but not this particular model, mm -hmm. just the model itself, because it's against the rules. Yeah. Uh, nuts and Stitches, uh, Ron actually has that. We do not know. Uh, we didn't check that before uh, we, we got We are on, close, so. Knots and Stitches. But uh, don't know just yet. Yeah. Anybody is asking if we're close or what is the 5,000 mm -hmm. engagements total? Yeah. We're close. Yeah. We're very close. And Tazalanch, yes. Don't forget Facepalm. Yeah, Facepalm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Book face. MySpace. <laughs> um, GeoCities. Mm -hmm. um, live journal was that the other one? Live yeah, journal live journal. In the day? Indeed or LinkedIn? <laughs> LinkedIn. Go share this on LinkedIn. <laughs> um, just wait for the announcements. Uh, we're really close, Red Skull. Mm -hmm. So anybody's asking for the engagement number, we're really close. So keep Silver, on sharing, keep on liking. Silverthorn, that's a very good idea to basically debut the translucent paints with the uh, the dragon. Oh, there yeah. you go. That's, that does sound like a great idea, actually. Uh, Google Plus. That one didn't really take off, did it? <laughs> uh, so we have the gym no. dragon that's the gym dragon and then we also have our um, backer mini so we've unlocked three backer minis mm -hmm. five ten and fifteen thousand backers mm -hmm. uh, it was the dire cabbage the pizza dungeon dragon and the three-headed troll uh, the three-headed troll is still being sculpted so if you see that on the corset graphic it's still being sculpted uh, so so as soon as we get those updates we will put them on there and we are also working towards the next backer mini which is the loot golem 
which is at the 17,745 backers. Yes, and we have that, the image for that. That was the number of backers, one more than we got on Bones 1, one. the very first Kickstarter that we did. Yes. So, yeah, if we can get to that many backers, then we have this one right here to mm -hmm. add to the core set. Uh, this guy is also going to be on a 2-inch base, mm -hmm. uh, so I think he's going to be relatively big, uh, just like probably the, the Fathom Tyrant here. He fits on a 2-inch base. Um, and it's really cool. He has like a jewel or a gem for his uh, his face. Uh, he has like a sword or a blade where all the coins and stuff are wrapping around the sword on his left arm there. Um, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, Achilles, how about uh, the Ed, Ron, Dave, Brother uh, Dave, not ordained heads on <laughs> our mischief? The the three-headed troll. The he, oh, the three-headed troll. For their uh, mischief. Yeah, we are, I'm talking with Ron about that. Yes. Uh, to have a side piece of plastic that can you mm -hmm. can switch out the heads. Yeah, really hoping for the loot golem. This one's great. Yeah, I, this is probably, if you guys have been on the Kickstarter comments, mm -hmm. a lot of people have been requesting a loot golem. So Ron just said, hey. Yeah. Chris, we go. what can you do about a loot golem? And so <laughs> we got a loot golem just for you guys. Oh, hey. Thank you. Thanks, Graz Yeti. Yeti. So, yes, we do look at the comments. Your, your feedback to us <laughs> is very important. We do watch it. Mm -hmm. uh, we watch your Twitch comments and all that. So, yeah, please let us know. <laughs> They said in Canada they got rid of the penny a few years ago. Yes, so they this did. is what happened. They all turned into a loot golem. <laughs> all the pennies collected, and now they're rising up. Uh, loot golem has been requested in the Kickstarter comments since at least Bones Three. Yeah, Chris. Has it? I didn't. Know. I know a lot of, especially the pirate ship. I think it started in Bones Three. Oh, okay. Um, so things that kind of carry over. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of the things I'm seeing right now are goblin one man band, is a thing I'm seeing a lot of. Mm -hmm. So goblin one man band. Oh, I see you guys. Yeah. I see you guys if you're in chat. Um, I see a lot of people asking for that. So uh, I don't know. Someone asked, uh, "Is that a, a throne in the back of Loot Golem's back, Panzer Zero? I think it's spears, but I don't know. Uh, Terry C. Wilcox. It's hashtag paints with an S. So if you do hashtag paints, it will enter you in for the giveaway. Yeah. Our current giveaway. Thanks. There you go. Now you're entered. You should have got a message from Mubot if you did get it. Uh, no, we do not have a, uh, that's a, uh, that's a good one for Ron. If Ron is listening, we do need a uh, back picture of the uh, loot golem there. Oh, yes. Uh, on the turnaround, uh, you guys can't see it, but on the turnaround of the, loot, of the loot golem here, he has a huge treasure chest that's sticking out of his back. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, so it's like, a, it's like a treasure chest that's kind of being swallowed by the coins and everything mm -hmm. that's on his body. Uh, it looks very cool. Yeah. Um, uh, someone was just asking Holly, and I, I can't remember her name. Uh, no, the expansions are not broken down like the core set yes. after the campaign is over. Mm -hmm. So the core sets will just be sold as, it's, as a whole thing. So you can see above me here on the main screen, uh, if we could take away the Luke Golem picture. If you look above me, these are the core sets right above me here from Bones 4. Yes. Uh, and they're just big boxes. Those are expansions. Those are expansions. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Corsets. sorry. Yeah. Corsets oh, corset. above Dave. Yeah. Expansions above me. So there's Bones 1, 2, 3, and 4 corsets above Dave. And then I have the Bones 4 expansions above me. So, uh, the expansions are not broken down, yes. but we do break down some of the corsets into smaller groups. <laughs> we don't know what how we're going to break them down yet because yeah. the campaign hasn't been finished. Yeah, it'll be towards the last week is what Ron said. Yeah. It's when we start finalizing everything and the Kickstarter, uh, the corset will start to fill out and we'll get a bigger picture of what it's going to look like. Then we'll put it on the pledge manager. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And if anybody's new here, the pledge manager right now is just a calculator. Uh, it's a big button on the main pain campaign segment. page. Um, <laughs> we're getting, it's like we've been doing this it's for three for weeks. <laughs> uh, it's on the main page. It's a big button. It says pledge manager. Uh, it's also in all the updates. It's super important. Um, right now it's just a calculator. So if you want to go in there and type everything, that's what it looks like on his phone. Uh, if you want to go in there and you can just click on everything that you want. So I want this dragon, I want this catapult, I want the corset, I want the Brian Wynn expansion. It'll calculate it all for you. But it's only a calculator at this point. Correct. Uh, when the campaign closes and we actually finalize the pledge manager, you're going to have to give us your name, address, contact them from all we get from Kickstarter is just your email mm -hmm. and we can't ship to an email so it's very important that you go into your pledge manager uh, and fill out all that stuff the final version of the pledge manager should have some shipping calculator and will also if you're overseas or something and there's VAT involved mm -hmm. taxes and that it will also include that yeah calculate VAT all your shipping stuff mm -hmm. so that that will be updated relatively soon I know Kit's working on it yeah so. Uh, let's see, Justin LeBlanc. Uh, hey, gents, I'm 
Sure, I saw Cerebus earlier early this lesson. week, uh, but never again. What's up with the sweet puppy? Hey, we got him. We do have him. Where? Somewhere. He's, he's up here. I'll oh, okay. Just, uh, John will be getting that. We'll take down some of these oh, wow. here. So this is a preview of the Greek Greek Odyssey expansion. So he hasn't been, has he been showed yet? Yes. He was in part two. Yes. I think he's in part two of the Greek Odyssey expansion. Here is the little puppy that, um, what was his name? Somebody in chat was asking. You just read his name. I forgot it. Um, but Oh, I'm sorry. Remember, the chat remember. does go by fast. Yeah, I'm sorry. Fast. <laughs> but here's the Cerberus. So I saw somebody saying that they saw the puppy. And yes. here he is. And here he is. Oh, part three. So Nearsighted Giraffe said. Yes. Okay. Thanks, guys, for keeping me honest. Part three, not part two. Hmm. Uh, Cerberus. Cer Cerberus, Cerberus. Cerberus, yes. Hercules, Hercules, Herc, Her however yeah. you want to say it. Heracles. Or oh shit, if you're actually <laughs> standing in front of him. <laughs> yeah. He's been shown here. Yeah. It's yes, he has. Three. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Guarding the gates of hell. All right, yeah. so we've done the social media, the backer. We've talked about the, the number of... Pay How many uh, back, uh, subs, gift subs, have we got to match so far, Justin? We have 27 so far. 27, okay. Come on, guys. You can make, you can make Justin hurt harder than that. <laughs> oh, gosh. Don't, don't, don't prod him, Dave. Don't do it. But, no, thank you very much for those, and uh, uh, we will match everything that we get today. I'm just uh, having fun. So chariots, carts, or any wagons previewed. So Blood Wild, come back tomorrow at 3 p.m. Central. Come back tomorrow and watch the show and I have a preview for you guys about along that line that of what you're asking for. Uh, Mail to Growth, could you please say something about uh, what being sponsored by Reaper entails? Um, yes, Justin will, will mm -hmm. take that question. So I don't know the details, mm -hmm. Collins does, because he runs that particular part of it. Mm -hmm. um, but he, I he believe, message, yeah, exactly. I believe in the, the spam that it's putting out um, let's see here. Uh, yeah, just message it, Reaper Collins. Yeah, He'll tell you all the details. Email. Uh, oh, Thanks, thank you for the gifts up. Uh, if you just email Michael at ReaperMini.com, he has all of the <laughs> details. Um, some brief overview of it is is <laughs> I think it it has there's products involved and stuff. Uh, yeah. You know. Yeah, there's a with lot of stuff. Stuff with mo uh, mo molecular structure. Correct. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, stuff I, and things. Uh, yeah. Abdul, uh, I don't know about a full expansion. I know of one piece that is. Well, we get some Egyptian themed minis in Bones Five. Yes, I've uh, seen I've seen one. You have, okay. But I don't know if it's a full expansion. I don't yeah. think it is. But I have seen one model that is Egyptian like. Egyptian ish. Uh, yes. Uh, yes, Diggy. These are still going up on YouTube. It's the, along the Anubis line. I still oh, okay. have the 18th to upload today. That'll be on there. That's from Friday, and then you'll see today's. So We've been we'll keeping Justin out. busy. So. Yeah, yes, to say the least. Anything to get Justin in the doghouse. Yes. Malin says. D no, Malin. Don't do this. <laughs> I, I was already bad enough this weekend. Don't add to it, please. Uh, no, Dave, I don't think so. What? Um, oh, the pledge, manager has, the pledge manager has shipping in it already. Oh, does it? One, I haven't checked it One, recently. I made my account and added my address to give it an estimate. Oh, I didn't know it had been updated. I don't know if that's true. Uh, I'll have to go double check. But yeah, I, we'll I have to check with on that. Because I figured we put a we, we would have put it was an just update be, about it. Yeah, it's supposed to be a calculator. Yeah. Someone hasn't been giving us updates. <laughs> uh, Def, uh, will the minis come glued to the bases? It all depends on if Ooh. they have a base or how the molding works, how the tooling works on how they make it. Because uh, we don't decide how things are chopped up. It's how they can make the tooling. So the, the tooling is very complicated. It depends on, on the number of undercuts and, and the best way to put it together. Yeah. Because uh, you cannot mold if you have something that's actually curving under. That's called an undercut. So uh, you actually would have to say, take off my arm and then glue it back on because it's now got this area here. Uh, what happened to the what happened oh. to the episode of Reaper Live on Thursday night? Oh, I got it. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, hey, Violent Trey. Um, nothing happened. It was perfectly fine. Yeah. What are you talking about? Yeah. What are, I would go get your ears checked. It was perfectly okay. Um, I think everyone in the chat will agree, right, guys? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Wink, wink. wink. Yeah. Um, no, it was it was a mix of soundboard and USB problems. Basically, it was uh, a little bit of everything, and, and but we got it fixed. So. Uh, Mike, will the Stygian Barge and Ghost Crew from Bones Four be available on the web store at some point? Yes, they will be. At some point, yes. Every, everything from Bones Four all the Bones will be released into production. Mm -hmm. Yes. We we slowly release them, t t like twenty five numbers at a time. Uh, yes. So that way we don't we don't <laughs> clog everything up super super badly. Th thank you guys for backing me up on that. Yeah. How, do you, that. how do you enter the giveaway? Sorry, new to these chats. And, hmm? uh, so TS, TS Tobbs, all you got to mm. do is type in hashtag paints. Yes. 
with a cap with an S. Hashtag paints. Hashtag paints. And uh, Mason was, an was saying that I touched Justin's soundboard last uh, Thursday. And that's what happened. Actually, that was actually it. we touched uh, yeah, the Justin doll. Justin doll. It's, Don't touch it's it. Cursed. Don't touch it. <laughs> so every time something, every time somebody moves it, we always have technical difficulties. So we try not to move them. That and I didn't use my usual. I'm very much a um, you might can call it superstitious or tradition. And I always come in and, and straight out of the movie Airplane, I always come in and go. I just want you all to know. We're all counting on you, just straight from the movie. And and whenever I do that, we always have a good uh, we have a good show. But I didn't do it that Thursday. <laughs> Paints with an S. It didn't work. Very funny. <laughs> Ephemeral Isle. Um, uh, yeah, I'm waiting for the Stygian barge myself. Forever Night says. And did you did you defrag the soundboard there, Justin? Yeah, you defrag. Yeah, that was part of the solution. That's why I was here that so and, late. And stirring the cryo tanks. I just stir the cryo tanks yeah. too. Okay. Yeah. So a lot of people are saying they registered for the pledge manager, and it's definitely adding shipping now. Okay. Uh, but somebody said that they don't know how accurate it is. So it is um, not accurate. Yeah, I don't so think because we don't have the weights on this stuff to begin with. Yeah. So, so once we finalize all the weights, probably just an estimate yeah. and the sizes and all that stuff, then it then it will be primo. So then it will be good. Is Ron in chat? If he is, maybe. Um, I can't us. remember his name. He keeps telling me uh, his name, but I can't remember. Chippa D, Chippa D H, Chippa Chippa something. What? I don't know. I don't know. It's a really weird. He needs name. to make another account. That's what's wrong Reaper with like Reaper Ron? Ron. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. He went with something weird. I don't know. He um, someone even gifted him a sub. So hey, he big has cave a sub. troll. Yeah. Yes, you only get one entry, so all you got to do is type in hashtag paints one time. Thank hey, you, Deborah. Hey, thanks for the gifted. Uh, Speaking of gifted, we are doing the Monday Blues for anybody that just joined us. Yes. Uh, Monday Blues, we do it every Monday here at Reaper Land. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's basically, we match all the gifted subs. So if everybody that gifts subs, we match them. Yes. So if we get 33, we'll, we'll do 33 gifted subs. So. Correct. Yeah, that's, that's the plan. Everybody, I hope everybody had a good weekend. Uh, yeah. We had some crazy storms, storms here last, last night. night. Yeah. We had a tornado, some hail. Yeah, Abdul, it is not a 1380. It's just an estimate. Yeah, yeah. I can guarantee you it's probably not going to be that low. Holly Monster, Reaper Land. I want to go to that theme park. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, the party's coming up, Holly. I know you're going to be there. Yes, um, Anubis. Oh, speaking, I'm sorry. No, go ahead. I'm, go I'm doing an ad to Ron here. Yeah. I'm talking over you. Uh, will you be restocking some Bones 4 miniatures on your site? Yes. Yes. Well, we got a big trailer in last week, our big uh, container. Mm -hmm. We got a big container in last week, and we unloaded it. Everything's being added, so... Everything's being yeah. packaged. Uh, we're we're putting it in our system to be calculated and keep track of. By chance, is there is Nethermall a part of that? He Nethermall. Was in, he was in Bones. Was too. was Nethermall the one that was discontinued? I can't remember. I I don't remember to be yeah. honest. That, there's one of them that was. Or was that the? You know what? I, I do all the metal casting here at Reaper, so yeah. I'm like the farthest away from Bones <laughs> as possible. And I haven't been on the production floor since like Bones yeah. 3. Well, so we will I get don't. it all figured out. Don't trust us. We're, 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 we're not professionals. Uh, someone <laughs> asked me about uh, Nether Mall the Undying. So. Uh, Caladrax uh, was discontinued. Forever Night, uh, we're waiting on the RSVPs to see if we will open up the other parking lot. As mm -hmm. I discussed with you this last Saturday, uh, we have a new property over here and we're looking at taking down a little bit of the fence so we can use parking over there and people can walk over. Mm -hmm. uh, it's really important, good side by there, yeah. that uh, you RSVP so we know how many uh, people are actually coming to the party on November 2nd and how many children you might be bringing. Um, we've already, have we gone over, there's going to be arcades and uh, arcade machines, the yeah. balloon twister. All the sculptors and painters, not all, but no. sculptors and painters will be there from the Bones 5 Kickstarter. Bob and Julie and, and uh, Jean, Jason Weeby, Gene Van Rhonda, Horn, Rhonda Bender. Bob and Julie. Basically just say the usual yeah, suspects. The usual. <laughs> uh, Christine will be here. So I know there's going to be a lot of people here for the party. As long as we don't fly that Proctor guy in. <laughs> I don't know. No, I'm just kidding. Love yeah. him, Proctor. Yeah, I don't know Clever if you're actually... Pro. He's probably not watching us. I don't know. Um, but if he is, hi. hi but Proctor. you can search that on Facebook if you need to RSVP. It's the Bones 5 Kickstarter Countdown Party on Facebook. Uh, thanks, Grim Held, for the Tier yes. 1 to, for the tier one Gifted. Uh, it's the Bones 5 Kickstarter Countdown Party. It's 5 with the number, not the nu Roman numeral V. Um, so Bones 5 Kickstarter Countdown Party. And RSVP, tell us if you're bringing your, your family, your yes. husband, your wife, your kids. It really helps us with the planning for the pizzas and, and balloon twisters and all that sort of fun stuff. Yeah, it'll help a lot. Um, so, yeah, where there's going to be arcades, foods, giveaways. Yeah. All kinds of things like uh, that. Justin, could you look back? Rap Mastery asked me a question, and it's already gone off chat. If you could uh, go back. And don't worry if you can't make it to the party, because I know a lot of people live in other countries or other states. 
Uh, we will be filming it. Uh, we will be live streaming. Actually, it. live streaming. Live yeah. streaming. Uh, yeah. Rap Mastery has a decent question. It's something that, that I have personally. A decent question. It, I mean, it is. It's, yeah. it's a good question, but it's been asked multiple times. But uh, they ask if we were doing a weekly or bi weekly. Oh, that's right. After, Bones the, five after the campaign ends, mm -hmm. right now we're going to do updates on Kickstarter Correct. first and third Friday. Right. But adding an actual video show to that. Wouldn't believe, be a bad idea. Yeah, yeah that I think we we're probably not going to be do the doing the daily thing like we're doing now because no. so much changes. Yeah. But yeah, at least probably every other week and maybe once a week uh, mm -hmm. once the campaign shuts down. At the bare minimum, it gives the the community the ability to kind of check in on where we're at. Yeah, and ask of, questions, yeah. give yes. suggestions because some of the stuff is still in the planning stage. Yeah, so. still being worked on. Yeah. Hey, nine hundred to go! Wow. Guys, oh. that'd be cool. That would be awesome if we got to unlock. How much? How much time? What time is it right now? I don't have my phone. My family. I'm a oh, uh, we got 25 more minutes. Uh, oh, According, wow, really? According yeah. to my updater, we only need 300 and uh, what is that, Dave? Quick math, 79. Yes. Because we need 45, right? It's yeah. 45. 2.145. Yes. Oh, that'd so. be exciting. We guys, we haven't had to unlock on camera in a long time. Long time <laughs> since you probably pushed the button. Yes, yeah, so <laughs> I think that that day it would happen so fast. Uh, yes, 379, Justin. Any tease or preview for the Chronoscope <laughs> expansion? So, Mike Lee, I don't have any previews for it, but um, I maybe it's soon. Mm -hmm. I know I know that there's a thing coming oh, up. Oh, there goes Holly Monster. She's going to take up the last $300 worth. Oh, Watch. Oh, thanks, she's, Holly she's Monster. She's going to do it. <laughs> I actually don't know. If she's Time for a ding. Oh, there you go. Hey, Down we're going to get 63. A, we're going to get a live ding. Oh, oh, here it is. Hype. Can we get hypes in chat, please? <laughs> Just everybody hype and chat. There you go. Hey, we did it. Oh, oh and we got Ed, Ed on a tractor. <laughs> <laughs> Added six for a catapult to help the cause. There yeah, you go. Yeah, thanks, guys. <laughs> That's exciting. Hey, hype. A lot of Thank hypes. you. Thank go you guys Holly. so much. Holly for MVP. <laughs> Well, apparently, yeah, there is still the vice president option running with Ron. So, you know. Yeah, yeah. oh, there you go. Now, right now, I think he's only assigned uh, uh, Bob, uh, no, Bobby Jackson as his secretary mm -hmm. of snacks. <laughs> secretary of <laughs> snacks. <laughs> Holly Monster, you rock. Yeah. Look, look, she's doing her little corgi. She has, she has two little hey. corgis. Oh, does she? Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. She'll have to. Uh... She streams, and so her corgis are always in the back. Oh, okay. Yeah. Love corgis. Yeah. I love all dogs. So. All dogs. Yeah, we're dog people. Yeah, definitely. Um, so, definitely dog people. Hey, so the Brinewind expansion. Is unlocked. There you go. Yeah. So now, now it's available as a fifty dollars option, and it's part one. Still got two more parts. So it's going to be awesome to go along with the ship that's coming out. That is coming. Good segue, soon. man. So the ship will be coming. It will be coming. Um, little little birdie told me sometime next week. Oh really? Maybe. Oh. Depending on how the pledges go. Yeah. But we're we're counting down. We're getting there. There's a ship, Emerald said? Yes. Wait, there's a ship? I can't believe... Wait, are they joking with me? Are they no. pulling my leg? <laughs> <laughs> Soon, TM. There's two ships. Technically, there is two ships. There. Well, yeah, that's right. Yeah, the little yeah, uh, dinghy. Yeah. yeah. Um, so or we just... Frigate, as Justin would call it. So that's exciting, guys. <laughs> Thanks, guys. For, there you go. I'm glad we were here for the unlock. Yeah. That's exciting. Um, there so you go. For anybody who lives under a rock, uh, this is the pirate ship. Or I keep calling it, it's just a ship. Mm -hmm. um, it's not a pirate ship per se. You can you could paint it like a pirate ship. You can make it look like a pirate ship. Mm -hmm. But it is just a generic, beautiful ship with a bunch of designs. It has little uh, seahorses holding up the railing. It has mermaids holding lanterns. Uh, the cannons are currently planned to be removable. Um, yes. So it's going to be beautiful. Possibly uh, on the the bow, the uh, figureheads. The figureheads. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right or, now it has a uh, female pirate yeah, with her pistols holding crossed. Holding two pistols. Yeah. Yeah. With a bandana on. Yeah. Um, so currently we're planning. I, there there is talks about having more figureheads, but rowboat or dinghy mimic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we just unlocked the Brian One expansion, so that's super exciting. Yes. Uh, and then I believe after the Brian One expansion, it is the. Encounter at Gallo, Gallo Guard. Which is done by Kevin. Kevin. Kevin, our staff sculptor, did mm -hmm. this one. And do we have the picture for Gallo Guard? We do. Uh, I've been watching Kevin sculpt this. Uh, so during my lunch break, I like to go up into his office and uh, just sit there and ask him questions while he's sculpting. There you go. And so he's been working on this. Um, and this is the Encounter at Gallo Guard. Uh, he's been really excited for the castle. Um, I started, I've been watching it. It's really cool to see mm -hmm. something start mm -hmm. because it looks very, he just does the outline of the... 
of the bridge and all this other stuff. And then you added the chain, and you know it starts to yeah. all come together, and it's very exciting. So I'm I, I see a lot of people are really mm -hmm. update is up by the way. So if anybody wants to go look at the update yes. on the Kickstarter page, uh, you get to see the next preview. The, vener um, the venerable Ron is on the job. Yeah, we just called Ron and said, hey, we hit it. But he's in his office. Um, um, Price is saying, uh, I saw your name in the question. You were asking, all, we gotta, all I got to do is just go in and say, yeah, I'm coming. Actually, we need to know how many people. If it's just you, just tell us yeah. one. But if you're bringing uh, your, your girlfriend, significant other, mm -hmm. uh, kids, kids, especially kids, we need to know how many kids you're going to have. Pull up the next preview. Do we have the next preview, Justin? I don't know if you have those graphics. Uh, uh, that is, isn't this the, is the encounter? Next the encounter uh, at Galagard? Oh, he's talking about in the update. Uh, in the current update, they, Ron always puts the next unlock at the bottom of the update. And that means that he probably has the graphics, so... Uh, we, we will try to get it. Uh, somebody was asking for the... Let's see, yeah. The at the very bottom. Brian Wine is, is unlocked, so yeah, we have encounters at Galagard, and we should have one more up. Ron! Ah, it is the Dark Depths Expansion Part 2. So if you're in the Kickstarter updates, it's at the very bottom. Mm -hmm. um, it looks like we have some dolphins. Uh, the Fathom Tyrant, which, which I will show off here in a second. Yeah. Uh, we have the Dire Moray. The Killer Clam. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That's exciting. We have the, oh, Brine Goblins. <laughs> so underwater Brine Golems. Um, and then two more of the Mer People. The Mermaid Ranger and the Mermaid, mm -hmm. oh, two Mermaid Rangers. So okay. a male and a female Mermaid Ranger. Mm -hmm. And then the Devil Ray, which I also have. Is oh, this Brian Wynn Part 2, you said? Yes, Brian Wynn Part 2. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Fry is saying, uh, actually, you can go to our Facebook, and under events over there, you can uh, tap that and tell us how many. Or, if you don't want to do the whole Facebook, uh, which I completely understand if you don't, uh, you can email uh, business at, at reapermini.com and just let us know. Uh, that you're coming and how many people you'll be bringing. Yeah. So I know a lot of people who don't use Facebook and stuff like that, so there you go. So we can go to the QVC cam here, and I'll show off some of the... Are you looking at the graphic? Uh, yes, I don't seem to have the Brian Wynn 2. Okay. Yeah, so that means Ron hasn't put it in our database yet. Uh, he just has it on his stuff, so he can update the Kickstarter page. Mm -hmm. But we will get it, so don't worry. Uh, but I do have some previews of the what was just shown off. The Brian. Oh, there we go. So the Brian Wynn Part 2, or sorry, Dark Depths Part 2. Mm -hmm. Dark Depths Part 2. Uh, this is the Fathom Tyrant. Yeah, sorry, guys. There's a lot of names going around. Dark Depths Part 2. <laughs> Dark Depths Part 2. Because uh, on my screen, I'm, re I'm looking at the Brian Wynn expansion. So, you know, sometimes whenever you're reading, you read what you're, you say yes. what you're reading. Yes. So, Dark Depths Part 2. Not professionals. Thanks, Metal Sheep. So it's not, it's not Brian Wind. No, it's not. Yeah. It is the Dark Depths Part 2. Uh, and so this <laughs> is the Fathom Tyrant and the Devil Ray. So these are the two that we have printed out right now that are in front of us. Mm -hmm. So, wow, that Tyrant is huge. Yeah, so a lot of people that are just joining us, uh, this got brought to us about halfway through the episode. Mm -hmm. So this is a little preview. Ron was there. going to tease it, and then he decided that we could show it. Of the Fathom Tyrant. Yeah, he looks really awesome. I like yeah. how big he is. And again, we have skeletons and treasure and everything else sitting right under him yeah, there. Yeah, he's, he's like standing on a pile of bones and like skeletons. It looks awesome. Man, it looks so cool. I can't wait people. I can't wait to see people paint that eye. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of people I saw in the chat were talking about how good the eye looks, mm -hmm. about how, especially how big it is. So you get a lot of good practice on doing a big eye and things like that. Does he have crab legs? Uh, it looks like he has little tentacles. Yeah. So it looks like he just uses, uh, has all these little tentacles that are underneath in there. You can see in the back right there. Right in here. Yeah. So I wouldn't say crab legs per se, but he just has crab pinchers, crab arms. Yeah. Uh, huge pinchers too. Definitely though. crabby. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't wait to see what people do with the teeth and the eyes for this one in particular. Mm. Uh, so while we're on the QVC cam, mm -hmm. I know a lot of people are really excited for the dark depths. Which was, which was named by Twitch Chat, which was named by you guys. Yeah. When Ron was on a few weeks ago, um, we showed he was asking for names, and he picked one from chat that he thought was cool, so you guys got to name it. Uh, for anybody that wasn't here last Friday, we showed off this guy. Uh, this is Eric Hoff. He got unlocked a few unlocks ago. Yeah. Um, and then he is an option, so if you get him, you can. he's an option. And he's big. He's huge. <laughs> and if you hate spiders, I'm with you. So anybody that saw this on Facebook, this is probably the most liked Facebook photo that I put up of all the new Kickstarter stuff. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it's like 350 wow. likes or something okay. like that. So A lot of spider likers A lot of there. people <laughs> like this model. So don't worry, guys. I'll be taking pictures of all the new stuff as we get them and stuff. So 
I missed that on Friday. See? Mm -hmm. You gotta... That's why we show some off. That stinger, yeah, the stinger looks really great. As he comes back around, you'll see it again. The kissing spider. <laughs> Remember when we had them face to face? Yes. Um, uh, Abdul Al Hazad, the uh, the final product will may or may not be in gray. I know that the core set will be in bones black, which yes. is uh, which is a darker gray. And if it's in the regular bones material, it'll be uh, somewhat of a whitish gray. Gray, like a a, a, a grayer. Right, tent. but not not specifically this gray. Yes. No. It'll be like uh, this color, just about. There you go. It'll be like this color. There you go. So it's not like translucent white. It just no. has like a gray tint to it. Yeah. So it looks incredible. It helps detail pop a little bit more because mm -hmm. uh, I know that the, the old PVC was a little bit translucent, so it'll reflect the light, so you lose a little bit of detail on the smaller models. But um, adding that little tint of color makes it pop. <laughs> so. So Sir Forscale is past his depth. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Right. The armor helped him sink uh, if he was facing off against the Fathom. But yeah, we can see that we can see them fight. Oh, there you go. Oh, what a what a picture! Look at that. <laughs> oh yeah, you could just paint a big hourglass right here for Black Widow. Yeah, oh yeah. Or Black Widow or something. Yeah. I can't wait to see that painted up. Somebody that does like a really good paint job on that, I'm excited. Mm. Um. So make there you them, go. Make them kiss. Oh, they're dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Twitch chat is obsessed with the models kissing. Uh, will the Albert from Dungeon Dwellers be available as an add-on? Uh, no uh, psychiatric memory. So everything that comes in an expansion mm -hmm. uh, will come in a box by itself. You won't be able to take anything out of the expansion specifically. And if you go back to John. Yeah. So I'll John just, has them. I'll just pull out the dread mirror. Yeah. So there this you go. is this is the Bones Four Dreadsmere box. Um, and this was the Dreadmere expansion. I believe it had like 46 or 43 mm. models in it. Um, and so they come in this beautiful little box here at this size. You can hear it shaking around in there, ASMR. But nothing in the expansions you can pull out specifically. So if you want something specific in an, ex an expansion, you have to buy the whole expansion. But after the Kickstarter ends mm. and everybody gets their stuff, then it'll slowly get added into our catalog as separate. Yes. Separate models. Uh, our Dead Skull Fo Firefox browser is not letting me log into the pledge manager. Mm. Thought this bug had been fixed. Uh, uh, don't know. Have you cleared out your your cookies? your cookie your browser history? Yeah. Have you defragged it? Defragged it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, I, suggest I would I would try that. Reset your computer and try it then. And if you haven't cleared out your browser history, I would highly recommend you doing or, that. Or or just if that doesn't work still, try a different browser. So yeah yeah like, Chrome like Google Chrome or, or, or yeah. I think it's Microsoft Element. Is that what they I call it? I have no idea. I haven't used it in such a long time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't use that. Toss your cookies. That's yeah. right. Um, so, yeah. Thanks, for guys, for hanging out with us. Uh, we're, we're getting towards the end of the show. Um, we still have a few more minutes um, mm -hmm. as we get start wrapping things up. So, uh, if you guys want to ask us some questions, don't, don't be afraid <laughs> to ask questions in chat. So, we'll try to answer them if we see them. Chat does go kind of fast when we have a lot of people in here. Uh, got a promotion at work specifically so I can afford more expansions this time. Well, Reaper. congratulations. <laughs> there you go. Reaper is the ultimate <laughs> motivator. <laughs> no, do not. Do not delete the System 32. Yeah. So any amount of support is, is welcome. If you can pledge a dollar, if you can pledge a hundred dollars, uh, any any amount is, is appreciated. We yes. love, we, we need it, like, it all goes a long way. Yeah. So, thank you guys. Well, uh, any of the miniatures coming to Resin. Aren't the dragon head? Isn't the dragon head in Resin, or is that going to uh, be in? That'll be in Bones. That'll be in Bones. Uh, okay. We did do we did do them for ReaperCon in oh, Resin. Oh, oh, okay. That's where I'm confusing it. Yeah. yeah. I don't think we're going to have any Resin in this Kickstarter, are we? Uh, no. No. Uh, okay. Baphomet. Do we use Reaper or Kickstarter login? Uh, for what Baphomet? Um, if you're trying to get into Kickstarter, you would use that. Uh, as far as the Reaper login, uh, you would. Yeah, it depends on which app you're you're in. Uh, isn't it just a link from our website into the Kickstarter? Mm -hmm. So yeah, you could be on our site and go there and st you'd have to use yeah. your Kickstarter login. Yeah, so I'm waiting for Baphomet to respond. And so mm -hmm. Justin LeBanc, hey, good question. Thursday, oh. uh, Reaper Live. So yeah. we have a whole series of shows. We do this from three to four. Mm -hmm. This is the Reaper Bones 5 Live. Bones 5 Live, every day at 3 p.m. Central to, with to Brother Dave and John Overton. Yeah, and then, John, take the Thursday. Uh, look at Wolfie. R remember that so I can okay. answer it. So on Wednesday, we have 1.30 p.m. Central, uh, and it's the Reaper Toolbox with Ann Forrester. Yes. Our, our uh, local alchemist. Uh, she's mm -hmm. the one who works here at Reaper make, mixing all the paints 
So she's the one who comes up with all the paints and mixes it and names it and all that stuff. Yeah. So. And, and that's Wednesday. And then we have Reaper Live on Thursday night mm -hmm. at 6 p.m. till 7. Uh, and that's just covering everything in the Kickstarter and what's going on yeah, at yeah. Uh, Reaper. And that's Ron and Ed normally. Yeah. Uh, Wolfie 75, you wanted to answer his question yeah, about the it? pledge manager. Oh, that after the campaign, can he add to the pledge manager? Oh, yes. So after the Kickstarter, um, if I've never backed a Kickstarter before, I'm going to make any good move. <laughs> uh, make sure that you use the same account that you used to sign up for the Kickstarter. This is how this is how you end up talking over people. So as John's yeah. answering something, I'm reading a question and yeah. I go, oh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, so yes, you will be able to add to your pledge after the Kickstarter is over. So in 12 days, when the Kickstarter ends, uh, we keep the pledge manager open anywhere from 6 to 12 months. It's in that window. It, it all depends Could on how things, how things are progressing. Yeah. So we'll give you plenty of updates when we're going to close them. Keep keep it tuned to Kickstarter update or yeah. this show, and uh, you'll get plenty uh, of emails and everything. Yeah, so don't yeah. worry. Uh, so it normally stays open for about six to twelve months in that range. So six to a year. Uh, so you'll be able to add more stuff and all that stuff into your pledge manager to get more things. Um, is the Earth Scion male or female? Uh, I would need to go look at the picture because I don't know off the top of my head. Oasis. Um, when is the paint drawing? Uh, paint drawing is Thursday. Thursday. This coming Thursday. Yes. Mm -hmm. At Reaper Live. At Reaper this Live, Thursday. 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. Yeah, this Thursday. And it'll be towards the kind of the end of the episode or the middle of the episode. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah. And um, uh, it'll be Ron and I that night. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you've never watched it, it should be good. We're supposed to have the live one mm -hmm. on one. Reaper uh, funny, yeah, funny yeah. bone matchup between Ron and I. If you've never watched it, we, we tell jokes uh, and then you get to vote on which joke you thought was the funniest. You can add multiple times too, correct? Yes, yes. Sin. So if you want to get the um, Dark Depths expansion, you put in $50, it'll charge you. Boom, mm -hmm. $50, you're in there. And you, you click the what expansion that you want. The, and then maybe two weeks later, you want to get the Brian yeah. Win expansion. Boom. Another one. The or, major difference is, is that at Kickstarter, when the campaign's going, you can add to it, but then you could subtract from it if mm -hmm. you want, uh, depending on what your wife says. Yes. Uh, then, uh, yes, call it by its real name, the joke off. I know, Swill. I know. Uh, uh, and, Ra but Ra after Yeti. after the campaign closes, when it's in the pledge manager, you can only add to it. Yeah, you cannot take money away. You can only add because it charges your card right away. Right. Yeah. Yes. Also, uh, Graziati, no, it does not disqualify you. So if you're unsure if you entered, I just got the email. Hashtag paints oh. again. We'll make sure that you're entered. Mm -hmm. um, all I ask, paints. It's it's with uh, with an S. With an S. Oh. Uh, Shut Kamani. You just typed in hashtag paint. It's got to have yeah, an S. S. Paints. Yeah. Uh, so there the, you go. So the Reaper yeah. Pledge Manager is a different thing than my Reaper account. Do I need to make a different account? Um, so I think you need to you need yeah. to have an account that is the same as your email that you use to sign up for. Uh, the Kickstarter. Yes, what we receive, what we receive from Kickstarter is just your email only, mm -hmm. and the amount that you <laughs> pledged. So, uh, yeah, when you set up on the pledge manager, that's a specific thing. You can probably still use your same uh, login or change it or whatever. I'm mm -hmm. assuming on the pledge manager, you don't have to use your Reaper account, but it is something separate than your Reaper account. Yes. We are, we are supposed to tell our wife a question mark. <laughs> uh, Chris Air, I can I can lend a, a thought. Yes, yes, you're supposed to tell. <laughs> yeah, As I learned this yes. weekend, yes, <laughs> tell hashtag, her. Hashtag pants. <laughs> Whatever you do. Uh, if we can't get to Reaper live on Thursday, can we still win the paints? Yes, yes. staff, and you don't have to be watching live. Uh, that's, that's the point of why we kept it open a week. So we give as many chances for anybody that, that couldn't tune in live that they could just come here and enter anytime. So we're just going to pull from everybody that entered. And you can still, when the, even though we're not broadcasting, you can still come to Reaper Live mm -hmm. and type in hashtag paints, plural, uh, and get your name entered in. In fact, like I said earlier in the show, we had 72 people from yesterday that logged in and did that. Also, a quick update about the concept art. We probably won't get that processed and shipped out until after the Kickstarter. Okay. So I have received the emails because um, there are people that have sent a couple of emails to kind of follow up. We don't currently have an autoresponder for that because of the way it's set up. I'm going to try to work on that. But it's a constant question where, hey, Thanks, did you get my email? Did you get my mm -hmm. email? Yes, we get. In fact, there's only been two people <laughs> ever whose emails we didn't get. And I reached out to them. So yeah. we're good. Um, Which is a good segue into the, uh, sh the waves. Just to remind some of the people on the Kickstarter, we have these waves set up, and the main reason is for us to help organize the yeah. stuff. Uh, it used to be, like what uh, Justin just got through saying, is, is that when we shut down the campaign and started shipping, 
Every backer, it seemed like, was emailing, calling, coming by, asking, are you shipping my order? Are you shipping my order? So, uh, the, uh, so what we do is we have it set up in waves, and we will broadcast which wave we're pulling so you kind of know if we're getting close to your, uh, to your order. Yeah. Uh, wait, no Reaper Live on Thursday? No, no. Rap Mastery, it'll be on Thursday. There will be one this week. Yeah, in fact, we're jo uh, Ron and I, we're having the... the joke the, off. The joke off. <laughs> live, one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, also, last uh, last heads up for this, but we're matching all gift subs. We're about to match it, so yeah. oh. we'll give you guys another minute or so. Yeah. If you want to give subs, yeah. we will match them. Monday Monday Blues. Uh, Julie Cat, why do we need to email Reaper? Um, just just to be nice? Uh, <laughs> no. Anything if to you're say, calling about the party, uh, then uh, the, the email business at Reaper Mini to let us know that you're coming and how many people. Uh, if you have a problem with your order, you can go to, is it help at Reaper Mini? and talk to our uh, customer service specialist so or you could just call or email us and say hey i'm uh, you know watching you guys uh mr powell um i mean any any amount helps so thank you <laughs> yeah so whatever any, any direction you want to take yeah any anything that you want to do that is that is great with us yeah so. if it's doable then it's okay for yeah. you to do it yeah yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. just make sure to work with the significant other yeah yeah <laughs> I can't stress this enough. Please do that. Yeah. Please work with your significant other, always. Uh, I saw a lot of people asking you about the sirens that we showed off in the last update. Mm -hmm. uh, as soon as we get those sculpted and everything, we'll, we'll show you guys. And everything. John, Harry uh, Winkler there. Any word on when the medals from MSP, MSP Open, Open will be mailed out? Um, I cast those uh, about a month and a half ago. And uh, I think they just got dropped off at Adrian's office. Oh, This today? over the weekend. Over the weekend. Yes. So they got dropped off this weekend because we have to make sure they go get plated and, you know, fixed up and fixed nice finished. and everything like that. So but yes, we are working. We have not forgotten you. Yeah, yeah, soon. And if uh, everybody in chat, if you weren't aware, we when we did ReaperCon, this uh -huh. last ReaperCon, yeah. we were overwhelmed by the total number of entries. Mm -hmm. uh, and so we ran out of some medals. So they're now waiting for their uh, their yeah. medals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so there, that, was a, that was a surprise to all of us. So. <laughs> big surprise. A good surprise, but still big. Uh, Justin, have you been checking out to who we might be rating? Oh, yeah. Yes, I have that set up already. Um, before we do that, yeah. though, um, I have to gift these oh, subs Oh, gift out. subs. That's right. That's true. Um, my kitchen table is currently covered with bones one through four. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Seriously. That's, that's a big kitchen table. Looks like the factory came over and bombed it <laughs> our table. <laughs> oh, may want to explain how you claim a gifted sub for those new to Twitch. Um, how do you claim a gifted sub? Uh, you don't have to claim one. Yeah, you just have to gift one to out. You? Correct. Yeah. So gifted sub in this case is that if you're on a computer, preferably on a computer, although uh, someone sent a link earlier on how to sub if you're on your mobile, yes. but I don't think you can gift that way. Yeah, you can't gift. Um, but if you're if you're on the computer, it's in the top right. You just click uh, the sub icon, and then and that, you they gift become a sub. a sub to our show. Yes. Correct. If, you, if you're in our chat, specifically mm -hmm. in our chat, and you gift subs, then it's it's to this channel. Yeah, it says you're forced to have it. You don't get to choose like, oh, yeah. I want a sub. I want a sub, so I'm going to go over here. So the no. gift is kind of random. Yeah. So if you have 100 people in chat and you gift 50 subs, it'll just choose 50 at random. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, they are given out randomly in chat. So anybody that's just joining us that's new to Twitch, welcome. We do the show every day, day. at 3 p.m. Central. 3 to 4. Mm-hmm. Uh, are we rating Mocha? Somebody says. I don't know. We don't know Justin yet. Is, Justin is Justin is leading us a, on the ledge here. It's going to be a surprise for us too. I like yeah. keeping it a surprise. So. And there is the thirty subs. Hey. Thank you, Reaper. Oh, oh, that's us. Ah. <laughs> yes. yes. Thanks, Reaper Minis, for the gifted. So, anybody that just got gifted a sub, welcome. Thank you. Uh, can we get some hypes in chat for all those people? Yes. Uh, Congratulations, everybody. Uh, I don't know, Tiberia. Um, that's a good question. I'll ask Ron about it. Uh, there is sales tax this time in, pro uh, yes, Rap Mastery, there will be. Yes. Um, as soon as everything gets updated and everything, so I still yeah. think it's being worked on and all that stuff, so it will be finalized soon. Uh, and not always people in chat either, yeah. Yeah, That's true. so. If you come and go, technically it can gift you a sub. Yeah, so yeah. say you have 100 people and all those people have subs, and then somebody gifts 50, the next 50 people that come into chat will get yeah. a sub. Uh, Rap Mastery, the sales tax will be for the state of Texas. Mm hmm. If you're not in the state of Texas, then it doesn't apply to you. Yeah, so thanks, guys, for all the hypes. Uh, so keep your hypes ready. Uh, we're going to be raiding somebody soon, so get your hypes all ready. Light the light the fires. I love when people say that. Yes, so. uh, Cyberstorm. Uh, we are actually in a county. We're not in the city of Denton. So uh, the sales tax mm -hmm. is six and a quarter percent, not eight and a quarter. 
Uh, so, Alex, I don't know how to hype. Does that make me old? <laughs> yeah. No, it makes you just like me. <laughs> so, Alex, uh, in your chat, you can see the little smiley face on the bottom right there. If you click that, it'll pull up open all the emotes that you have. So, if you could just click the one with But you Sophie. have to do it in the message bar, not on your, your mobile device. Yes. Yeah. All right, everybody uh, piling on this raid here. Yeah. Uh, this guy actually has a... Um, he has a, a follower goal, and it looks like with the number of people we have, if everyone goes in and follows, we will demolish his follower goal. Yeah. Okay. So, That's exciting. Yes. It should be, it should be fun. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Epic yeah. death. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. And uh, just spread the Reaper love. You yeah. Know? yeah. Get, the, get your raids, your hype, yeah. Bones 5. Let me log in right now. I'm so proud that I'm at, uh, John has shown me all this stuff about Twitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is just my, this show is an excuse for me to hang out with Dave all day. So. Yeah. He's the one that keeps me up on everything that's going on that's cool in the world. All right, guys. So All right, I think guys. we're ready. Well, you have a good day. Well, and thank we you will... so much for being here, and we yes. will see you tomorrow. See you yeah. tomorrow. And I'm Dave Pugh, uh, Brother Dave, not a priest. I'm John, and that's... And we're joined uh, with... Justin. Justin Elliott, our mm -hmm. spiritual advisor, and our ethical advisor, Michael Collins. Uh, see you guys tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you guys. It was so cool to get a live unlock. That was cool. Yeah. That was nice.